In this tutorial, we will show you some of the new features of Word 2013. The new Word comes with a comprehensive template directory, which can be accessed by going to the New tab. A few suggested searches are lined up at the top of the page, or you can simply scroll down and see all the templates. Once you open the document, the first thing you will notice is that there is a button right before each paragraph. Through this button, you can show or hide the paragraphs. When zooming in and out, you can feel the smoothness in the new interface. Another new feature is the reading mode. Go to the View tab and click on the Read Mode button to activate it. Use the right and left arrow keys or buttons to navigate through your document. Special focus has been given to it so that unnecessary utilities such as the toolbar, ribbon, and scroll bar do not appear while reading unless they are required. To exit from the reading mode, simply press the Escape key. By going to the Insert tab, you can insert pictures directly from the web. Go to the Illustrations group and select the Insert Online Pictures button. A new box will open from which you can search for images. After the search is complete, double-click on the image to insert it. The downloading time depends on your internet speed and it may take a few minutes to insert it. Once the picture has been inserted, you can drag your image wherever you want and the text will be adapted accordingly in real time. A simple click on the image will show you the layout options and resizing buttons. If you want to increase the number of rows or columns for your table, take your mouse to the divider of the row or column and when the plus sign appears, click it. Adding new rows or columns to the already inserted table feature gives you more flexibility while working with tables. You can now add Office applications to your Microsoft Word 2013 suite. Go to the Insert tab and click on the Apps for Office button. The Insert tab box will appear from where you can select and search for different applications. If you want to install an application, Click on it and your internet browser will open up, displaying you details about the application. To download the application, click on the Add button. The Review tab comes with a new Define feature. Select the text and click on the Define button. Once the dictionary is installed, you will be shown the definition of words or phrases on the right sidebar. Gone are the days when you had to use third-party tools to select pictures or texts from the PDF documents. Now you can simply open the PDF document and edit text and tables, resize the pictures, and add or remove information from the document. You can manage your account settings by going to the Backstage view. Your office background theme can be changed from there. 